Alright, so what is good everybody on YouTube? This is your boy Young Nick. Coming back to you guys with yet another video. And do y'all like the new setup? I moved the boxes there instead of back where they were. If y'all can see that. Do you like the setup better? Does it look better? I think it does. I personally think it looks better. I honestly think the setup is better, but hopefully y'all think so. I don't know. I don't know if y'all do think so. Hopefully y'all do, but I do. The boxes are back there. But yeah, let's just get straight into the video. I just want to go ahead and rank from worst to best of the all of all the Air Jordan releases, All Star Weekend release, and basically February. Now this year, they really got some good shit on the list. Like there's not really much trash or garbage or garbage or basuda. The reason I said the S word, um, because good S H R T, because I can't think of a better word to use. Like, please help me, Dad. Mom, Dad, I didn't mean to say bad words, but I just couldn't. Can you at least like? Make suggestions on what words she was writing good S H I T. Like I don't know what would sound better. Like, I can't think of anything that would sound good. That's the only thing that seems to like, you know, sound right and stuff. Like, yeah. It's really the only word I could think of to you. So yeah. It is soup the suit it is Super Bowl Sunday t today. It's February fourth. But you'll see this video on February seventh. So yeah. I'm my cousin birthday. So happy birthday, Sam. He's eight years old. I love you, bro. Love you, buddy. I, I look how this Yeah, He was in my New Year's video. So, yeah. I have one quick. I just want to show you guys real quick before we get straight into the video. Go Eagles. Screw the Patriots. I want the Eagles to win. Yeah, it did snow. Kind of went away a little bit. Yeah. So, yeah, guys. The snow kind of melted a little bit. A little bit of it went away. So, yeah. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Remember to smash the like button, comment, and subscribe. So first up, the first first up we have we have on the list we have the Soulfly and Jordan collab. This is a lightning pair. This is a lightning pair of the Air Jordan 17 Low. Now, I'm not that big a fan of these, but this colorway ain't that bad. So, yeah. It's number 15 or 14, whatever. I don't really know what order they go in. So, yeah. Next up, we have... Next up, we have the Air Jordan 8 in the Valentine's Day colorway. Oh, wait. Are there shoes? She was an all red suede Air Jordan 8. Now, there's. There is like. Um, I don't know. Now, there is like. A little heart on the tongue embroidered in. It's kind of girly touch, if I'm going to be honest with you. And there's a whole bunch of women's sneakers that I think are dope. I just... Wish that heart wasn't there. There, It is a woman's shoe, but it is what it is. I need to bring that closer. Like, it is what it is, guys. So, yeah, that was number 14 or 13 or whatever. So, yeah, wait, what was that? That was 14. Now we're coming into 13. So, ne next up, we have the Air Jordan 1, supposedly the Air Jordan 1 All-Star. And let me just tell y'all, 
pictures of these joints look crispy. The leather looks all pebbled and nice. But I've heard from another YouTuber that these don't look as good in person as they do in pictures anywhere you've seen where you've seen that the shoe it either had the kith filter on the i or the ig filter or someone heavily edited it so the air jordan one all-star has a map on the insole i think it's just funny to it's just funny to me that this is an all-star shoe i ain't gonna lie they're not that bad though i kind of do like them i won't be copying any of these though So this next release, yes guys, I am cheating you guys a little bit because it drops in March, but they preview that with the with all the All-Star shoes that are dropping. And that is the All-Star, that is the Air Jordan 3 Flyknit. And you already know there is a pretty strong and hate relationship on them right now. Now with this now with these Flyknit out OG Air Jordans. Now, I'm not that big a fan of these. I'd rather have a leather pair of the Air Jordan 3s. But this all black pair ain't that bad at all. From what I have at what I know, this sole at, does actually glow in the dark. Bring back the most 2012 Galaxy vibes right there. Ain't that bad, though. That was number 12. That was number 12. Now, moving in. Come Moving and moving on to number eleven. Now next up, I'm not going to lie to you guys, but this shoe. Wait. Now next up, I'm not going to lie to you guys, but this shoe ain't that bad. Um. Uh, this shoe ain't that bad. And that is the All-Star Air Jordan Jordan 9. Um, very simple all black new buck or suede uppers. White leather, yellow accents, and I think it has the same kind of insult as the Air Jordan 1 All-Star. Now, even though it is an All-Star, it's even though it's an All-Star um release now, even though it's All-Star color it is very very basic and very a very very safe bet these are actually these actually dropped on February 3rd which was yesterday but you won't be seeing this video until February 7th so yeah guys so yeah that was this one right here that's the Air Jordan 9 I just talked about very dope so I like them a lot Kind of like that. Now coming in at this is like ten or eleven. We have uh, th this one right here. I'm not sure how I feel about these, and that is the Tinker Air Jordan Three. Jordan Three. Now I think the concept of this shoe is better. Than how it actually looks, but I think this one's actually okay because it's an Air Jordan 3 with a swoosh added onto it. It's not that bad, and I think one really important feature of the shoe, one very important detail, is the toe box. On the toe box is a drawing, very thin, very light, streamlined looking toe box, which looks pretty good. So I think this shoe was a stronger concept than the actual shoe will be, but I think it's okay right there it's like 10 or 11 I think yeah 10 I'll say yeah guys that was that one alright so coming in at number 10 I mean 9 or whatever Next up, we have a Jordan 1, a Jordan 1 bread toe. That never failed. Red and white, red, white, and black on an Air Jordan 1. Air Jordan 1 bread toe. Now, you know I'm a fan of these. I really like them. Not.
but like them, not from what from what I've seen, the shoe does have like a slight off-white kind of feel. On the side, I hate saying off-white, but it sounds better than saying cream look. Now, I mean, it's a red, black, and red, white, and black Air Jordan One. These never fail; they're going to sell out. If you want these, you don't sleep and don't be lazy. I do really like these, but not as much as a Game Royals, just because blue is my favorite color. This is like ten or nine. Right there. There's another pick. Call them mine. That was number nine, I think. Number nine or eight, eight or nine, one or the other. So yeah. We're coming in at seven or eight. We have the Air Jordan One. And our classic color doesn't fail there. Air Jordan 1 colorway. This one's going to be in the Game Royal. Now, there is no official release date of this shoe. It's just said to release sometime in February. The all over Game Royal, white and black and blue. I talked about these a little bit in one of my previous Heat or Hype videos. Jordan 1, it's really hard to mess up an Air Jordan 1. At this point, any simple color combination that looks decently clean will work. In my opinion, these are fire and very dope. I love them. I would definitely. Cop them. And we got them. So yeah, that was number seven or something. Yeah, that was number seven, I think. Yeah, so coming in at number six. I mean, yeah, number six. There's another Air Jordan 1. Next up, we have an Air Jordan, that Air Jordan 1 gold so, Complex Con, we had the Air Jordan 1 Top 3 Air Jordans drop. Black, white, gold, patent leather, crazy release, super limited, Complex Con exclusive. A couple months later, we get Top 3s that re-release. Once again, the Complex Con exclusives have dropped, one, dropped again a little bit more wider, but they dropped again when they were supposed to be just an LA and Complex Con exclusive. Two months later, we jump into February, and they have recycled the same shoe three times. And this shoe, you shoe is was dope in my opinion. It is fire. I love them. And uh, right there, and um, right there. I love the shoes. Very dope. And so coming in um, for number four and five. Next up on release on the on the list y'all know this one had to happen and that is this is number four and five the OVO Air Jordan 8s we have seen these over and over there's been pictures of Drake OVO whoever and Air Jordan 8 and I love the Aqua 8s that's all my favorite that's my favorite Jordan 8s and so we've known about this shoe for a very long time we've just been waiting for a solid re release date which the solid release date is February 17 2018 so if I had to put these in order from what shoe I like better, I'm not sure. Probably the black ones than the white ones. Like I probably like the black ones better or the white ones that or the white ones better than the black ones. I'm not sure though. These shoes are hard. I really like both pairs. Very dope. Um there they are. White pair I like better. I'll put white pair in front of black pair. So yeah, that was number four and five. Moving on to number three. And come next up at number three, next shoe is going to be the Black Cement Air Jordan 3. And these do have Nike Air on the back in the retail this year, which I thought was interesting. It's going to be 200 bucks. Last year we got the True Blue 3s, and I think those retail for 225 Super mass produced. I think these shoes are very dope. Um, oh, why is that lighting? Why is it so dark? I'm so sorry about how dark it is. There they are right there. That's number three. As you can see, there's Nike on the back, and then, yep, yeah, very dope in my opinion. Yeah, so that was number three. Coming in at number two, and at number two we have the Dunk Contest White Cement Air Jordan Threes. With the red line on the clear sole, and most. People will probably put the Black Cement Air Jordan 3s over the Dunk Contest Air Jordan 3s. White Cement Air Jordan 3s. And here's a picture of them. 
And I see the clear sole on the bottom, clear bottoms. And it's snuck here on the back, and there's that with the tag on it. Yeah. See, that's number two. I love those shoes. Now, the last shoe up on the list is... Now, coming in at number one for me is the Air Jordan 1 and Off-White collab. Okay? Like, these are fire. For me, it's the Air Jordan 1 Off-White collab. Now, I would rather take the Chicago pair of these, of the Off-White Air Jordan 1s. But these are still very dope. I just really like the look of these. Like, I like the Carolina blue hang tag. I just fuck with the all white look. It, just in my opinion, this is going to be the hardest all star release of February. So that's going to be about, that's, that just about wraps up this video. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Wait, and there's a picture. I forgot to show you guys. Very dope shoe. I love those. And I'll show you the, Car the Carolina blue. Right, right here. There's the other YouTuber I was talking about. Oh. And I also want to know how to edit. See that Carolina blue hang tag? I really like it. Those are very dope, in my opinion. So, yeah, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Much love to all the fan followers and supporters. You guys follow me on Instagram, SoundCloud, Snapchat, Twitter. Snapchat is Nick Moore 9 by the way. Here, there, by the way. Of course, Young one Nick. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I need a better, I need a bigger tripod. I need to start sitting in a chair or something. Because this camera angle just, just ain't good. It's just terrible. This camera angle. And yeah. Hope you all have a great day. Don't forget to smash that like button, comment, and subscribe to the channel. So yeah. This has been Young Nick. I am out. Peace. Go Eagles. Screw the Patriots. Hope the Eagles win. Young Nick. I am out. Peace.